Hey guys, Nick here. Uh, first and foremost, before I get started, I want to just kind of apologize for not uh, putting up any vi videos recently. Uh, I've honestly been intending to. There's many videos that I want to do, but I simply haven't gone around to them, or then while I'm halfway through making the videos, I simply lose motivation in doing so. So today I decided I'm going to try to put up another video, this being it, so, uh, anyways, I'm showing you how to remove the casing on your Xbox 360 Slim AV cables, as you can see the yellow, white, and red, how to remove this casing, because for Christmas, uh, this past year, I got a pair of Turtle Beach headphones, uh, for Christmas, and... They're mainly meant for PS3, but you can use them on PC and Xbox 360. Well, that's cool. I have all of those. So, uh, but one thing, or one way of setting this up, is you got to have left and right audio cables with an HDMI, which is what I use for my uh, video is an HDMI cable. Well, that's neat and dandy and whatnot. You just got to... It's pretty easy setup. You just gotta make sure the preset is on 360 on my headphones. Plug in your HDMI, and then plug in your AV. Oh, wait. How how does that work? Uh, I don't know. Maybe let's try it like that. See, it fits now, so it still doesn't. Oh, that's right. There's this fucking little tab right there. Just one of the few ways that Microsoft really tries to money whore, really squeeze money out of the consumer. And one of the most pathetic ways possible. I'm no expert, but I'm pretty sure it costs more money to get this little tab than it did to actually, to actually just let people use the HDMI and AV audio. And they have two ways of doing this. You can either buy this $50 HDMI and AV head, which basically comes like this. I'm pretty sure I have the head upside down, but it comes like this, and it's $50. But that's a freaking crapshoot, if you ask me, especially since now you can get a pretty good pair of... Uh, you can get a good HDMI cable, or like a three or four pack of them for like that much and then just in general on every other console on the Wii U on the PS3 on the PC and I'm pretty sure even the PS4 uh, you can use your Turtle Beach or have an external audio like say if you have a surround surround sound setup system stereo system but you can't because of this fucking little tab well I'm here to show you how to take care of that now instead of shelling out 50 bucks or 30 bucks for that separate audio output, uh, one thing that you can do is pretty simple. You don't need any special tools or anything like that. All you need is either a, a flathead screwdriver, a very thin flathead screwdriver, or a very thin po pocket knife like this. This is a piece of crap. But basically, on the top here, what you'll want to do is get the knife, now this is going to look a lot easier, because it is, slip it in like that, and then kind of wig at first. I'll tell you this now, for people doing this for the first time, it's going to be pretty difficult to, you're going to have to really wiggle it in there, and then you're going to have to kind of turn it like that, and then, but eventually you'll hear a pretty bad breaking noise, and it'll sound like it's uh, breaking while the casing is but don't worry a uh, lot there's like no exposed components inside then you just lift up on that and then just simply remove this bottom half and voila you just took off the casing along with the tab so now you'll see this this gives you the freedom to use your HDMI and your AV audio so you can either send it to separate say if you have a surround sound or if you're using Turtle Beach headphones like I am and as you can see there's no exposed components and then uh, this part right here is solid 
So now, just plug in your HDMI cable and plug in your AV cable like that and now you can use external audio or headphones, whatever you have and it fits right in there and works like a charm. So yeah, sorry about kind of my little ramblings there guys, but thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. Uh, like I said, I'm going to really honestly try to get more videos out. Uh, I definitely want to do reviews. The PS3 3000 is still definitely of interest. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I shall see you later.